Hello guys, guys I'm going to show you how to take a computer apart, or well, not apart, take the front cover off. All you need is a flathead shoe rifle or a Phillips. Luckily for me, I'd have to do it in my screws. They are literally hand on. So let's take these off. I'm going to show you how to take the front panel off. Some, in some computers, you, all you need to do is take them off from the front. You don't need to um, undo the case or nothing. Some front panels, you need to um, unscrew them, like my old one. Or some is just literally. Yeah, some is just got little things on them. Like clips type things. Right, after you've done that, take the case off. Both sides. Right, as you can see. I should now show you. Just up here somewhere. There you go, you see just and there, as you can see that black one, it's a little clip which I should lead and squeeze. I have three of them on each side. So I was trying to see if I can take them off. I've never done this before so I'm just going to try and use a screwdriver, so I've never done this before, so it's all new for me, so... Oh no, what am I doing? Right, as you can see, I've got one clip off. There you go, as you can see, I've snow off. One thing I forgot to mention actually is to unplug the case wires. That's what I forgot to do. If I've got two fans in the front, I'm just going to put the camera down for a minute. Right. right, somewhere in the back of here, I should have fan wires, which I think this needs to one is right here. Actually, I'm going to cheat and right, undo them. What do I need to actually? Oh, what I could do. What I'm doing instead, guys, is unplugging them case wise now. As you can see, I'm unplugging them two wires. should help me when I undo these case oh I see all these wires everywhere I should not think that's gonna help much even I do undo that anyway right, I should unplug all the wires look so I need to unplug that one and that one If I can even get come out. There you go. Well, I need to unplug that one. And that one. Alright. 
I'm gonna quickly see if I can get some of that. Right, I don't really like these plastic clips, but I'm gonna try and break this one off. damage the wire at the same time. As you see there's a little plastic clip just now I'm gonna try and get rid of. Hmm I don't want to damage the wire so you right. can move the camera out of me. I did have some pliers somewhere, but I've lost them. Actually, I might see if I'm quick. Give it enough of a look. It would help a lot more if I had pliers, but if I can't find them, I should have to do without. The camera's bloody dropped. Cool. Hmm. I could help a lot more if you cut them back to ties, but I don't seem to have mine. I may not have misplaced them. Right, I'm just going to quickly try something. Alright guys, I've got the plastic tie off. Alright, put that back on there. Right. I accidentally unplugged all them, so if you unplug all the power switch cables, I don't know if you can read them. Right, that one, can you see that? It's all like HDD lights and stuff. But no, you could put it back on, they're not exactly hard. You've got no order and I have to go in. Take one number. Right. Oh. right, now nice little one plugged, actually. Quite easy, you have to take this off now. So, you want to put the wires like that. As you can see, it does get quite dusty down there, and so it's important if to clean these out. One good tip I f think is to clean these out is some. You might think you pick them up, pick up the big bit, right? Uh, pick them up, get them off. But you still have a little, you still have dust on the fans. But one good thing to use is actually a paintbrush. I'm just going to see if I can get the camera in a good place. Right, I'm going to zoom in a bit. You see all the dust coming off now.
I'm gonna put a fan down or the fan on my camera down. It should be easier. If you want to get the brush in, you know, give it a good old clean on both fans. And literally, you have to refer to how you put it back on, really, or trick it off. Pop the clips back in. Really, but it depends on what case you got. Some like you know screws. Some you've got like clips on the outside and stuff. Looks like that. Got a camera shot. Yeah, but mine is just clips. And you've got to get them unclipped. You know. Don't forget to do the front of the case. The both fans are like the blue, and you've done so. I'll do close and later one. I know, power it back on. But yeah, you should really. I think that's about it, really. But yeah, and paintbrush, you believe, quite good. You get rid of the dust. You might think that's just it, but no, it's not. If you look down here, if I can get a good. You might be able to see some of the dust still on the case if I clean that off. Does get a bit dusty, you know, but. Right, we're next to that back on. And now we're to put the wires back through again. You can want to put the case down there, getting it back on the way. You want to put all the wires back through where you found them. So you want to put them, these wires, back through the port up in there. You want to push them through like that. You're going to push the camera on there quickly, we need to do something. Right, then that. Right, go back that way. Had to do something there. Right, yeah, you like you just want to put the wires back through. Okay. Yeah, he's got. Hmm. Right, why not? There you go, after that. 